all. Welcome to CEC lecture. The topic for the lecture is World Environment Day. In this lecture, we shall discuss important themes of World Environment Day beginning with the year 2018 up to 2022. This lecture shall also deliberate and elaborate on significance of observance of World Environment Day and highlight the important aspects covered by the various themes of World Environment Day 2018 to 2022. Margaret Mead said, we wouldn't have a society if we destroy the environment. The World Environment Day is led by United Nations Environmental Programme. It has been held annually since 1973. It is celebrated by millions of people across the world. On the first day of the Stockholm Conference on Human Environment, which was held in Sweden, from June 5, 6 to 6 June in 1972, the United Nations General Assembly had established the World Environment Day. As we'll reflect on this history, the 1972 United Nations Conference on Environment in Stockholm was the first world conference also to make the issue of environment a major issue. Further, reflecting on the important history from that conference, the Stockholm Declaration and Action Plan for the Human Environment, it placed environmental issues at the forefront of international concerns. Later in 1987, it was decided to select every year a host country for Environment Day celebration every year. The World Environment Day is celebrated on 5th June annually. The important aim of observance and celebration of World Environment Day is to encourage awareness and support environmental protection. According to United Nations, reflecting on the significance of World Environment Day, celebrated every year on 5th June, from the perspective of the views presented at various reports by United Nations, the celebration of World Environment Day provides us the opportunity to broaden the basis for an enlightened opinion and responsible conduct by individuals, enterprises, communities in preserving and enhancing the environment. Let us understand the significance of environment. Now we all know our surroundings are the essence of life. Further, the recent pandemic reminded us of the harm that we have caused to Mother Earth and how important, how essential it is to protect the environment. The World Environment Day 2022, Sweden is the host country and the important campaign slogan, Only One Earth. This campaign slogan focuses, gets the attention towards an important aspect that is living sustainably in harmony with nature. So it's important to understand that the earth, the planet earth is very precious. We all must get together with commitment to preserve the earth today because of various human induced and certain other natural factors, the earth is witnessing, the earth's environment is witnessing depletion. 
the World Environment Day 2022 with the campaign slogan Only One Earth tries to get a consolidated action, joint thought process with the focus on the important idea, living sustainably in harmony with nature. Going further into the historical aspect, looking at the year 2021. In the year 2021, the World Environment Day theme was Ecosystem Restoration. Now, what do we understand by ecosystem? Ecosystem can be defined as that is consisting of all the organisms and the physical environment with which they interact. Further, when we talk about ecosystem, the biotic and the abiotic components are linked together through nutrient cycles and energy flows. When we talk about ecosystem with reference to the theme of World Environment Day 2021, the term ecosystem restoration implies to assist to get together in ecosystems recovery. It then becomes essential to reflect on that what are the causes of harm to ecosystem. Ecosystems are degraded by deforestation, pollution, human activities, etc. Further, it is essential that there is a need to get together to look into ways of promotion by taking measures to conserve the ecosystem which should always remain intact. Looking at the important perspective pointed out in World Environment Day theme 2021 that is ecosystem restoration, the reports of United Nations pointed out and reading from the press inputs presented at un.org that what could be the ways of ecosystem restoration and it is highlighted that it can take place in other ways, including afforestation, namely planting trees, greening cities, changing the diets, cleaning up rivers and coasts, uh, rewilding gardens, rich biodiversity and green ecosystems, they yield immense benefits. In the year 2020, 20, the theme of the year 2020 with respect to uh, the issues concerning Envir World Environment Day has to be seen with reference to the context of the year. Now, the year 2020, 20, there were environmental crises. In 2020, there was news about wildlife fires ravaging tropical rainforest. There were news about Australian bushfires locust attacks across Africa, the coronavirus pandemic and all of them conveyed a very important sign and that was human health has to be linked to planet's health. Further, talking about the World Environment Day 2020, the theme of the World Environment Day 2020 focused on celebrating biodiversity. Therefore, it put forward the need to fundamentally rethink our relationship with the living world, with natural ecosystems and their biodiversity. The World Environment Day 2020 with the modern theme of celebrating biodiversity presented some important significant message also and therefore it becomes essential to reflect on significance of the theme of World Environment Day 2020 that is it urged upon people to focus on environmental role in providing essential infrastructure which supports life on earth with a message to celebrate and preserve biodiversity. Now further as we all know that today environment 
is under various kinds of threat. An important threat concerning the environment and the surroundings is that of air pollution. How do we define air pollution? Air pollution is contamination of air by harmful gases, dust and smoke which affects plants, animals, humans in a drastic manner. The causes of air pollution from the exhaust from the vehicles, factories, dust, pollen, volcanoes, wildfires amongst others. Now all of the increase of harmful gases, the dust and the smoke, of course it contaminates and pollutes the air but at the same time it has a long term health effect namely heart disease, lung cancer, respiratory disease. So with all these health effects on the human beings because of air pollution. As we talk about air pollution, it becomes important to point out here that the theme for the 45th World Environment Day in the year 2019 was Beat Air Pollution. This called for action to combat the global crisis for fresh air. As we just discussed, air pollution, contamination of air by harmful gases, dust and smoke affecting plants, animals, humans in a dramatic, drastic manner. Air pollution is one of the important and major environmental issues ailing the planet earth. Therefore, the theme of 45th World Environment Day in the year 2019, Beat Air Pollution, it invited, it urged upon people to consider, to think how lifestyles could be changed for a better and cleaner environment. Air pollution, as we all know, is a global emergency. Air pollution as an environmental issue is affecting everyone. So therefore, it is important as the reports from the United Nations with respect to the 45th World Environment Day in the year 2019 on the theme Beat Air Pollution, it called for the need to look at the importance of from the part of communities, individuals, government agencies, industries to explore various sources of renewable energy, green technologies, which in turn will help in improving air quality in cities and regions across the world. Further, as we talk about certain dangers towards the environment, Plastic pollution as is indeed another important environmental issue. Plastic pollution can be defined as accumulation in the environment of synthetic plastic products to the point that they create problems for wildlife and their habitats as well as for human populations. In the year 2018, the theme of World Environment Day was Beat Plastic Pollution. It is important to point out that in the year 2018, India was the global host country. Now, in the year 2018, on World Environment Day with the theme Beat Plastic Pollution, there were several deliberations, remarks and it was observed that plastic which is rampantly polluting water bodies, harming marine life, posing a threat to human health has become one of the major concerns of environmental bodies as well. With plastic going by some important data pointed out at the deliberations in the year 2018 that plastic making up 10 
परसेंट ऑफ टोटल वेस्ट जनरेटेड हाफ ऑफ इट यूज इज डिस्पोजेबल और सिंगल यूज दिस प्रेजेंट्स अ मेजर प्रॉब्लम एज इट इज नॉन रिन्यूएबल एंड इट्स मैन्युफैक्चर एंड डिस्ट्रक्शन एक्सपोजेस इंडिविजुअल्स एंड द एनवायरमेंट टू मेनी टॉक्सिन्स इंक्लूडिंग कार्सिनोजेंस सो देर फोर द थीम इन द ईयर टू थाउजेंड एटीन बीट प्लास्टिक पोल्यूशन द वर्ल्ड एनवायरमेंट डे पॉइंटेड टू वर्ड्स द इम्पॉर्टेंट चैलेंजेस प्रेजेंटेड बाय प्लास्टिक पोल्यूशन सो देर फोर इट इज एजेंशियल दैट वी मस्ट रिफ्लेक्ट ऑन द सिग्निफिकेंस ईच ईयर वर्ल्ड एनवायरमेंट डे कैरीज फॉर आस वर्ल्ड एनवायरमेंट डे इज अ इम्पॉर्टेंट कॉल for awakening of individuals to take charge to come forward with respect to the important duty of protecting the environment and realize the severity of plastic usage air pollution by ecological problems climate change in daily life it is important as it was pointed out in the year 2018 world environment day on the theme beat plastic pollution that it is important that people must consider how they can make changes in their everyday lives to reduce the heavy burden of plastic pollution on our natural places our wildlife and their own health as we move towards the conclusion with respect to understanding the ideas that have gone in with respect to the various themes of the world environment day as we reflected on from the time framework of 2018 to 2022 it becomes essential to reflect on the significance for a healthier environment for a green surroundings as Aldo Leopold said and quoting Aldo Leopold's famous words here conservation is a state of harmony between men and land so therefore it becomes essential that is we must celebrate each day as environment day every day is environment day so save your day by saving the environment day so it is essential that we must save our day by saving our environment the concern for environment from ecosystem restoration to containing air pollution beating plastic pollution to celebrating and pledging support for the idea that it's only one earth it becomes essential that we must get the spirit of environment day every day every day let's save our day by saving the environment we hope that the lecture on world environment day presented to you significant inputs and insights we look forward to positive encouraging feedback and support from your side to conserve preserve and safeguard the environment thank you very much